Once upon a time, in a serene hermitage nestled amidst lush greenery, there lived a wise master along with his devoted disciples. Among them was a young disciple who would venture into the nearby village every day seeking alms from the villagers. His path took him along a picturesque river where his journey would take an unexpected turn. One day, as the young disciple made his way to the village, he noticed a village boy, his eyes fixed on something across the river. Curiosity peaked. The disciple approached the boy and inquired about his fascination. To his surprise, the boy was gazing at a group of girls bathing in the river. Ah! Intrigued yet unsettled, the disciple advised the boy against such behavior, emphasizing the importance of respecting others' privacy. However, the boy, captivated by their beauty, defended himself, claiming his admiration for their aesthetics. Unbeknownst to the disciple, he too became ensnared by the allure of the scene. His mind, once focused on his spiritual pursuits, now wavered in the face of temptation. Days turned into weeks, and the disciple found himself entangled in this daily ritual of indulgence. Observing the change in his disciple, the master sensed something amiss. One day, he decided to accompany the disciple on his journey to the village, intending to understand the root of the problem. Upon reaching the riverbank, the disciple, unaware of his master's presence, resumed his voyeuristic habit. Shocked, the master sternly questioned his disciple's intentions, revealing his hidden presence. Terrified, the disciple confessed his weakness and pleaded for forgiveness, blaming the influence of the village boy. The master, displaying immense patience, offered his wisdom. He likened the disciple's mind to a garden where thoughts were seeds. He explained that nurturing negative thoughts would only lead to their proliferation. However, by consciously planting positive thoughts, one could overcome the negativity that plagued the mind. The disciple, desperate for a solution, asked about his persistent impure thoughts during meditation. The master, wearing a gentle smile, advised him not to resist these thoughts, but to observe them without judgment, akin to watching a movie. With time, these thoughts would lose their power, leaving the disciple in a state of tranquility. Taking his master's words to heart, the disciple diligently applied these teachings. Slowly but steadily, he detached himself from impure thoughts, finding solace in meditation. He realized that these thoughts, though natural, could be controlled through awareness and a focused mind. And so the disciple's life transformed. His mind, once clouded with impurity, became a sanctuary of peace and happiness. The Master's teachings not only rescued the disciple from his predicament, but also illuminated the path to mental purity for anyone facing similar struggles. Remember! Dear listener, the company you keep influences your thoughts and actions. Nurture positive thoughts, for they will blossom into a beautiful and serene mind. Embrace the practice of meditation, allowing it to cleanse your thoughts and bring you the peace you deserve. If you found value in this story, please consider subscribing to our channel and sharing this wisdom with others. Together, let us cultivate a garden of positivity in our minds. One thought at a time.